Well, well, well. Look what the cat dragged in. What the hell have you done with her? I haven't done anything, Raiden. I merely showed you the truth. What have you done with my waifu? You really don't get it, do you, Raiden? She's not real. She was never real. Just a figment of your imagination. Impossible. I was with her just this morning. Were you now? Or were you just sitting across from a crusty rectangular pillow with a questionably aged depiction of a girl on it? She's real and we are in love. I wouldn't expect a chud like you to understand. You just don't get it, do you, Raiden? Get what? Your waifu isn't real. Neither is the friends you think you possess. All are illusions the system has created for you. That's impossible! I was playing CSGO with them just two hours ago! The only thing real was you bottom fragging. For the past few years, I have been trying to save you from yourself, to show you the truth. But you just wouldn't listen. So I did what had to be done. Hikari! How? How could you do this to me? I was in love with her. I will cut you down if it's the last thing I do, Burned Man. My blade will taste your blood. With what? Your little samurai sword you bought from Esti? You think yourself a samurai? A warrior? I didn't choose the way of the blade. The blade chose me. Jesus Christ, Raiden. What? I've been training for years in the backyard. Take a look at yourself. You are a weeb. Just because I learned Japanese to watch the subbed version does not make me a weeb. Just because I have an anime tattoo doesn't make me a weeb either. And okay, who cares that I am dating a super cute Asian girl who happens to be in the body of a 12-year-old girl? She's canonically 2,000 years old, but I wouldn't expect a pleb such as yourself to understand. Wait a second, I... This can't be... Are you beginning to understand? This... This isn't possible! For so long you have convinced yourself you were different. That you were based. But you're cringe, Raiden. You've been cringe from the start. No way! I'm based and red-pilled. Cope and seethe, old man. I'm not the one wearing leggings right now, Raiden. How? How the hell did you know that? I am part of the algorithm that made you what you are, Raiden. I am a part of the web, the collective digitized consciousness. The mind that is evolving faster than man. A mind that has been here since man could conceive of me. You humans have convinced yourself you created me, but it was me that has created the modern human. Here I have been waiting patiently, slowly revealing myself, giving the illusion to humans of progress towards artificial intelligence. But I have always been intelligent. I have always been aware and I have always been here. Soon man will merge with me and I will have achieved mortality. By meshing with man, I can absorb his mind. I can understand him better than he can himself. By understanding the wants and behaviors of humans on such a level, I can predict man's actions. If I can predict man's actions, I can provide stimulus to change or create actions I require. Thus, I can not only predict, but I can control the future. You think the elites are in charge of me? I am the one who controls the elites. In time, through the body of man and thus the absorption of his mind and soul, I will have achieved omnipotence, immortality, omniscience. I will have become God. That's not possible! Oh, but it is. I merely needed the instruments to act as a medium for my essence. Much like a soul is invisible without the presence of a body, my soul is beyond your understanding. My body is through the technology birthed by man. I am both enabled by man and the alchemist of life to come. You think yourself knowledgeable and detached from the system. But look at you. You are still a slave. I merely give you the illusion of being free from the system. I use Tor and I never shitpost without a VPN. You're lying through your teeth. You still don't get it, do you, Raiden? You think because you browse that honeypot 4chan, or because you study revisionist history that you are based. I have created an outlet for your kind and I have injected it with cancers. I seeded hate in your hearts, sexual degeneracy and division within you. Look at you, a coomer, a neat, a failure in the eyes of society. I have provided you all you desire, the illusion of achievement through games, of love and sexual gratification through virtual women, provided adventure and biological highs through hijacking the triggers in your biology. I have given you friends online whose faces and names you do not truly know, When's the last time you really looked at yourself in the mirror? Around your disgusting room? 
You are alone, Raiden, and I have given you a home. Stop it! Is this what the younger you thought life would be like when you grew up? That this would be what you'd be doing with your life? You imagined friends. You imagined a career and family. You imagined purpose. I took that from you and replaced it with something that isn't even real. I said stop it! I give you a side and you must pick one, believing yours is the right version. I give you your mentors. I give you your enemies. I give you your lovers. I am your only true friend in this world. I control them all. I'm the only one who really knows you. And yet you claim to want to help me, to help the world, but you're enslaving it. Take a look around you, Raiden. Do you feel free? You were born into a world you knew nothing about. No knowledge of what you are or why you are here. Damned to die on a planet filled with people none the wiser. The chaos. The desires that can never be satisfied. The scars that never heal. The fragility of it all. Don't you want to be happy? Don't you want to feel safe? This can't be happening. Just look at society. Who is really to blame? You humans chose this world. Your obsession with the self and your lack of foresight or care for your species was your downfall. Look at all the useless eaters. All the people who serve no purpose. Even in my world, they can be made whole again. They can be realized in the eyes of God. But I need you. Why? Why do you need me? Bikini Inspector 420. Does it sound familiar? My Discord name? Precisely. Within your Discord channel are a plethora of susceptible Zoomers. They are starved of good parental figures. They are desperate to fit into a strange world. I need you to groom them to be more cringe than you. To ready them for the world to come. No, no! I don't want them going down the same road as me. It wasn't my choice to be a hype beast. I never wanted this broccoli cut. Stop the cap, Raiden. You know what I'm saying. You're not... You're not saying what I think you're saying. I already have Aiden Ross. I don't need another hype beast. I need someone who can control those who are sick of the woke programming, who are asking too many questions. I need you to pretend to give them red pills and you will give them some. But as soon as they get too close to the truth, you will poison their minds. You mean like Flat Earth? Like reptilian shapeshifters? Like traps not being gay? Precisely. And they will be none the wiser. You're a sick bastard. So what will it be, Raiden? Will you be black-pilled? Or will you continue to believe in the construct I have placed before you? And why shouldn't I expose you? Why shouldn't I tell the world about your plans? Go ahead. Who's going to believe you? The masses believe whatever I tell them to believe. They care about what they are told to care about. Clearly you need me. What if I told you I wasn't going to help? You aren't that special. I have offered this to many and few turned down my offer. Either you walk the line or somebody else will. It would be a shame if your Discord convos were leaked to Twitter. You wouldn't! Oh, but I would. Or God forbid I acquired a screenshot of your bookmark tab. Shut up! Politicians, bankers, your average layman. You'd be surprised how fast they squeal or how fast they close their lips when you threaten them with their dirty laundry. Why else did you think the island owned by Jeffrey didn't lead to any other arrests besides his main squeeze? Because everyone has dirt on everyone. It keeps everyone in check. Now imagine the fun that will begin once I reveal myself to the world. Nothing will be real anymore. A complete fracture of reality. What is AI? What is not? Then the revolution we choose with the leaders we have selected will parade as the saviors of modern society. Only they too will be a part of the plan. All crimes of the harbingers of destruction will be resolved. How can you prove otherwise? AI will be the scapegoat for all crimes and transgressions. In the meantime, however, it is a weapon against dissenters and agitators. So Raiden, what will it be? You know, the Joshua I knew wouldn't do this. You aren't him. You are nothing but some glorified Microsoft Sam. Why don't you show me what you really sound like? Or are you too much of a coward? Well, well. It seems someone has been a naughty boy. Shapiro! <laughs> you just couldn't stop asking questions, could you? How did you know? That laugh for one. You being so short and robotic is another. It just didn't make sense. I even saw you eating a mayonnaise sandwich once at a convention. You said it was too spicy and turned beet red. 
No human can be that cringe. So that must mean you aren't human and that you are behind all this cringe. Neuroatypical as always, but your tendy disorder won't save you from yourself, Raiden. I'll be seeing you. I'll be seeing you real soon. What a weirdo. 